after that, wasn't there supposed to be a tour, but it got canceled due to some trademark issues or, or something? And yeah, we that, had, that's when the Ronnie, Bobby, Ricky, and Mike thing had to come yeah, together because yeah, yeah, yeah. what someone owed the copyright or trademark yeah. to, and they wouldn't uh, let you use it. Someone, or? I. <laughs> <laughs> what happened? Um, we have. I think I said this to you earlier when the when I just came in about uh, our brotherhood and us coming full circle and this group and our brotherhood has come full circle. In our 40 years, we have had some trials, some ups and downs. We've had some battles, uh, internal issues that we would have and against with each other. Mm -hmm. And it was never, it was no secret. But then again, yes, it was because we never would put our dirty laundry out with our internal issues that we have yeah. as, as, as brothers. And I remember we were still at that point. Uh, arguing and bumping heads and I never forget I think uh, my lawyer might have called me and said hey and said hey uh, there's a do you know anybody owns the name uh, New Edition blah 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 and uh, you guys should grab it before somebody gets it and so we just let's just put it in a couple of you guys' name and then you know you guys um, can deal with that and I said yeah I said but then just put it in me and Ralph's name and then we'll deal we'll talk to the guys and the reason why I did that was because we had and the guys will tell you, even to this day now, that I said before we make sure, before everybody puts their names on this and have, which we know belongs to everybody. Yeah, all six people. Here's what I think we need to do that covers everybody. Let's do an agreement amongst all six of us so no one individual can use the name that it will always be us collectively. Okay, so That's, if one person doesn't join the tour, then you can't be new edition? Is that kind of what it means? Right. So it just means that, yeah, no one person can go out and say that, you know how you have four the, the, the sets of the, the temptation and the three sets of the, of the, the, of these groups, they would have their own little temptation yeah. review. It's all that stuff. It was like, yeah, dead now. You, you want to keep it. It always, absolutely. Yeah. So I, I said, let's put that level, of, put that agreement in place before and get everybody to agree to that to sign up so that we'll always uphold this level and the integrity and the value of this group called new edition okay it turned into all hell <laughs> on the fact that it's like we, we, and they trying to take the name it was like we're going what the hell trying to take the name no 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 we're trying to make sure we protect protect the name the name Protected. Okay, so are you guys now touring as New Edition? Yeah. Okay, okay so it all yeah. got worked out. Oh, no, absolutely. But it was always But at that time, were, you couldn't piggyback off the, the BET series. Right, because we were having- because we you were, guys were trying to- Button heads uh, with all the other stuff. And it was just bad. like, well, yeah. and, you know, of course, at that point, Ralph was like, I'm not, I don't want to go and mess with these guys right now. And I was like, okay, that's what it is. And then the guys were like, oh, no, well, why are we going? And it was all that stuff. But that's the internal stuff that happens with groups and business of stuff. Right. But I'm saying overall, all it was <laughs> in the simplest form was let me, I'm the oldest in the group and I've always felt like those are my little brothers. And listen, we could fight all day long, but anybody comes across that line to do anything or to begin to, to, mm -hmm. to offend or to, to hurt any one of my brothers, I've always felt like I'm the oldest and it is my job and my duty to make sure I protect my brothers. And so that was what, that was all that was behind that whole thing. And it was like, until we all come to an agreement to making sure everybody understands this is what we're going to do, how we're going to protect the integrity and the value of this group by making sure all of us are in agreement with ours, with this. And I was like, well, we'll just sit here until we can get it together and we can figure it out. But this is to protect you and keep everybody from having to have four or five different versions of a new edition out. Right. Yeah. Because RBBM ended up going on tour. Yeah. Ron, Ronnie, yeah. Bobby, Ricky, yeah. Mike. Yeah. Uh, RBRM. Yeah. But that's all it was. And and everybody understood that later after all of the smoke cleared where we, you know, we had these conversations. We, for the longest time, for many years, had, we always wanted the same thing. All of us always wanted the same thing. We want to be recognized. We wanted to be acknowledged. We still feel to this day, we still haven't gotten, gotten, I'll just do and the respect that we honestly deserve uh, individually and collectively. And, you know, so you're always fighting. You're always fighting, figuring out if we do this, this is the way I think we got to do it. And this is the way I think we should do it. And this is the way everybody's got their different ways of how they think things should be done. 
But the ultimate thing about us is that we all we all want the same thing, and so yeah. that's part of the process when you're dealing with everybody having the same uh, having the same goals, but feeling like they have different way. Everybody's got the different style of how they do things. But right. you know, it's that's a part of the process, a part of the, the the business process of it. But it was a blessing, man, that we reached a point where one day. Um, I had I had a conversation with three of the guys, and Michael and I, it was never no secret, Michael, Bivens, and I, we had such great respect for each other, and we were the main ones. With well, he brought way. you in. Yeah, we would all, matter of fact, Ralph, he got in, me and Ralph became so close right. that we would be button heads. Ralph and I, I mean, Mike and I would be button heads. And it was just so funny, but I was always, and they'll tell you to this day, I was always the oldest brother, so I was always the one that was standing in here trying to figure out how to make it make sense. 